guys, I've just arrived in Izmir, Turkey. The flight was lovely actually. I slept through it all because it was so, I was so tired. Um, just check going to the baggage arrival now to get my bags and yeah, pretty tired. Um, so, so tired, so exhausted. <laughs> So I can't wait to get to my hotel and just chill a little bit today. Uh, yeah, apart from that, the flight was lovely. It's really good. The clinic sent a taxi uh, to pick me up. So Thank you. <laughs> that's my taxi picking me up and taking me to my hotel. So I'm here at my hotel. This is a Hilton hotel. Uh, the room is for two people because they expect you come with someone to look after you. But I'm here on my own, so that's why there are two beds. I went for dinner because I was so hungry when I got to the hotel. Hey guys, so I'm straight to eating because I'm exhausted and that's the food. Thank you. And uh, it's actually it's actually nice, you know, to have a bit of a time to myself. Um, I miss my kids so much, especially my baby. I miss him. I just spoke with him and I got tears in my eyes. I miss him so very much. But yes, I'm looking forward to going to Mono Clinic tomorrow to have my consultation. And then we'll see how it goes from there. Love you. Hi. Yeah, okay, no. <laughs> All right, can out. you video us, please? What's the yes. name? Yes. Can, can you do video? Bye, Can. Bye, Can. Oh, How are you? Welcome again. Hi, Marina. Oh, so lovely. A quick photo. Yes. Quick photo. Quick photo. So, where's going there first? Yeah? Hey, guys. Uh, good morning. It's the it's the morning before my surgery. I was asked to wake up early, uh, shower, but without um, any um, like soap. Um, I only use soap on my face, but not on my body. No cream, no perfume, nothing like that. So I've just um, had a shower. It's uh, 5.15 a.m. now. And my appointment at the hospital for my surgery is for 6.30 a.m. Uh, so it's pretty early. Um, yes, I'm just getting ready. Um, I'm waiting for, so once I get ready, the taxi will come from Mono Clinics to pick me up and take me straight to the hospital um so yes i'm ready as you can see no makeup uh i did a little moisturizer um non-scented moisturizer and that's it and um you're asked to wear comfortable clothes so i'm just wearing um like my joggers um as you can see, I'm just wearing a tracksuit, very comfortable, you know, um, and also they do make sure they tell you to wear something with a zipper 
uh, something you can just easily take off so you don't need to stretch your, your arms after your surgery. You won't be able to stretch your, arm, your arms up for um, a few weeks, I guess, so or a few days, depending on how well your body heals. Uh, so yeah, um, yes. I'm a little bit anxious, uh, but excited at the same time. I saw the doctor yesterday uh, during my pre-surgery appointment, and he was really, really amazing. He um, put my worries and my anxiety uh, to rest, sort of. We talked about what I wanted. We talked about you know the surgery itself and how um everything is going to turn out he showed me photos and yes i just can't wait you know previously i thought i was going to have an implant uh, but he has told me that i do not need an implant because i have a very um i have a high a, a lot of tissue in my boobs i keep saying boobs breasts boobs yeah um, and because of that, I won't need an implant at all. Uh, she, he's just going to do um, a lift. Um, he's going to do a reduction and a lift. And it's going to look as natural as possible. And it's going to be very firm. It's going to look as if I've got implants, even though I don't have implants. Because I do have the advantage of having very large and a lot of breast tissue. So... We're not having any implants um, anymore. It's just going to be, you know, a reduction and an uplift. So I really cannot wait to see um, how that um, is going to look. Um, yeah, so I was told not to eat after t uh, 12 midnight yesterday. So I had my last dinner at 11.15ish. Um and yes, that's it. No water, nothing. I'm very thirsty now. I'm usually when I wake up in the morning, I drink like two gallons of water. Um, yeah, such a water person. So it's um a bit difficult today, not drinking any water. And I can tell my body's already feeling it. Just waking up without water is something I don't do. I usually drink water, you know, but it's fine, you know. Um so yeah. I'm going to the hospital. They've told me to take off my earrings. So I had two pairs in there. I've removed both of them. Um, these are my natural nails. So he said it's fine. If they were artificial, he would have told me to cut this one and cut the other one. But these are natural. So he said it's fine. If they do need to cut it, they will cut it, you know, for me in the theater. Uh, but for now, he doesn't think it's going to be a problem uh what else what else what else you so yes that's it um i've done my before photo before surgery photos in in the uh clinic yesterday so they took a photo of my front my back my sides all sides of my boobs and everything just so i can compare sorry just so i can compare after the surgery um yes to see like the before and the after so guys yeah yes 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 it's it's very very real now and i would see you guys when i get into the hospital i'll do a bit of a video when i get there as well and yes morning of my surgery <laughs> I'll see you guys later. Bye. <laughs> so guys, it's the morning of my surgery on the 3rd of June. And this is me just getting out of the car into the hospital where they need to check me in. I'm just checking in now into the this is my room where I'm going to be staying after my surgery. This is a decent size, it's a decent room. I think it's, it's nice. That's where I'm going to be staying after my surgery. 
so i'm just going to relax here i'm just going to rest here um and the doctor is going to come any moment from now to do the markings and um yeah i need to do covid test as well this morning before the surgery um and yeah that's it so yeah it's looking cozy in here <laughs> that's it so guys i'll keep you updated i'm just going to wait now for the doctor to come hello guys i need wi-fi wi-fi password please <laughs> it's getting so real um i couldn't sleep last night at all and the car was with me at 6 15 this morning a.m to pick me up from the hotel and yeah it's been yeah i was i just couldn't sleep i kept waking up waking up i probably stayed for three hours <laughs> you know um yeah you just get anxious isn't it uh but I'm a bit, I'm a bit relaxed. I'm a bit relaxed now. And I know that it's going to go well. I feel it. I know it. I'm claiming it, you know. Um, it's so easy to let the negative thoughts come, come in. But I'm a positive person. I feel my thoughts with positivity. And I am feeling my thoughts today positivity my surgery is going well everything is going well recovery is going well i am fine i will be happy with the result and everything i want i will have that is my affirmation for today um, yeah so guys i'll see you guys soon okay hey queen so i have just changed into my hospital dress which i'm calling hot summer dress and uh, the nurse is about to come and do my blood work hi coming up yeah hey guys I just finished my surgery um I'm a bit beat up to be honest I'm a bit beat up as I'm so I'm so 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 tired um I'm not in so much pain, but it just feels like the truck has run over me, you know. Um, yeah, I'm so uh, tired. I've been trying to sleep. I need to sleep a bit more um, to sleep off the anesthetic as well. So I just wanted to update you guys. Surgery went well uh very very well i'm so glad it did and um everything is fine i don't know for some reason i woke up with a swollen lip i don't know why it's just swollen on this side so i'm going to ask my doctor what happened here if it's an allergic reaction to the anesthetic or something I, i'm not sure what happened um what happened there but I feel okay I'm so glad 
everything went well i'm so glad to be out of surgery um eventually so guys um yeah i can't really talk so much because i'm so tired i've not had any food um or water i think they're just preparing my water now because i feel very dehydrated too so i need some water and some food to drink yeah okay so they've just brought some some water now which um i can drink on my own and yeah um i need to sleep a bit more and then i will do another video you know just so i feel a bit better and more awake to tell you guys you know everything about the surgery but so far it's looking good looking high up here there's no implant just a reduction and a lift and it's looking really good really really good i cannot believe that's just a lift and an implant and a reduction without an implant like that looks amazing it looks like there is an implant but there's none um so yeah that looks really good and um yeah i'll talk to you guys later bye